So good day everyone, I am Charlene A. Baluloy and I will be the one who are your reporter today. So our topic is all about the concept and nature. So intended learning outcome. So later on, we will be explained about the nature, concept, and meaning of the self. So we will be uh, explain yung about concept at yung meaning natin sarili. Describe the nature of the self from your point of view. And we'll describe natin ano ba yung nature or ano ba yung nahanasan na meron na sa atin. And discuss the conceptualization and definition of the self. And develop pleasant and wholesome attitude. At ayun na yung mga madidevelop natin yung about uh, sa ating mga pag-uugali. So, the philosoph- uh, philosophical view of the self. So, about, according to Socrates, know yourself. So, by doing ourself, uh, by knowing ourself, uh, it is hard, it is required to us to ask a hard question for us to uh, know more better of ourselves. Kung ano ba tayo. So, ito yung nagre-required kong, um, nagre-required sa ating na tanong yung sarili natin about mga, uh, yung mahirap na mga tanong. So, uh, pag ginawa natin yung Diba, pag tinanong natin yung mga, uh, yung ating sarili na uh, ma- mahirap na tanong. So, like, dito natin ma-determine kung ano ba yung kahinaan natin at ano ba yung uh, weaknesses natin. So, pag nalaman natin yun, doon natin makilala kung ano ba tayo talaga. Ito yung mga paraan para makilala natin yung, yung ating sarili. It is according to Socrates. So, according to Plato, ideal self and perfect self. So, when we say our ideal self, ito yung nandito na eh, yung nasa atin na. Tapos, yung uh, perfect self, it is uh, ano pa yung, or trying yung, uh, kailan pa natin malaman. Or, perfect self, it is not uh, actually almost perfect, but we are trying our best to make it perfect. So, Immanuel Kant, perfect Uh, respect for self other so respect of self so ito yung respect ano ba yung uh, matatawag natin yung respect sa sarili how we gain that so paano ba natin magiging yung respeto ng ating sarili so according to uh, Emmanuel Kant respect for self kailangan natin muna ng si respeto yung sarili natin bago tayo Uh, kasi pag nakita na yung mga tao sa atin na nare-respeto na yung sarili natin so they can also respect us hindi man, nat- di man nila tayo marespeto na as a professional as kahit ano mang tingin nila sa'yo so as pag nare-respeto natin yung sarili natin irerespeto ka din nila dahil, dahil nga nare-respeto na yung sarili mo nakita nila na respetado kang tao so parang ano lang yan eh parang Uh, give and take kung anong binigay mo yun din yung sasauli mo kung nare-respeto mo sila ire-respeto ka rin nila so yun yung big ng respect for the self so Rene Descartes I think there, therefore I am so according to uh, Descartes I think before I am ko una uh, in the word itself I think Ito yung pag-iisip natin. Oh. Ito yung mga uh, iniisip natin bago yung sarili natin. Iisipin muna natin yung ano ba? Or bago ikaw, therefore I am. Yung sabi nun. So, John Locke. So, personal identity. According to John Locke, uh, history is about personal identity. Ito yung pag-determine natin na uh, personality or ito yung yeah. identity ng about isa or it is our identity ano ba talaga tayo uh, it is takes um, gender um, age it is all about our identity uh, it is also about language it is also our identity and about personal Ito yung about sa sarili natin. Ano ba, ano ba tayo? Ito yung 
uh, personalidad ng isang tao. Ito yung ano ugaling meron ka? Or ano anong kasikang tao? Or ano ba yung ma identically uh, identity mo na ikaw talaga yan? So that is about personal identity. So let's move on to David Hume. So the self and the bundle fear of the mind. So it is the self. Uh, ito yung sarili natin. It is about theory or nakabanda siya sa ating mind. Yung sarili natin it is uh, nakabandal siya sa ating uh, isipan or it is come from our mind para ma-determine kung ano talaga yung ano ba talaga tayo so that it is all about even you so ito pala si, uh, si Plato uh, Emmanuel Kant Trinity Secretis and Jad Luke and David Hume ito, ito yung mga philosophy uh, ito yung mga philosophy ito yung mga uh, mga philosophical and at the same time sila yung mga estudyante ni Socrates dinedevelop ng nila yung mga um, about yung uh, natutunan nila sa kanilang teacher so the Christian Bible could be of the self so according to the Holy uh, Spirit man following his redemption by the savior from internal bondage now shares the infinity matters of his redeemer self and multi count for the creation so uh, crown of creation dito natin malaman about ano ba yung crown creation so uh, the crown creation of the self ito yung napaloob sa ating sarili it is uh, about religion uh, aesthetic moral, sentimental, sensual and sexual, economic social, intellectual political, spiritual and religion, uh, rational physical and emotional so ito yung mga crown uh, sorry, uh, crown creation of self which is uh, nakapaloon na sa rin sarili may nabubuhay ba tayo religious so ito yung mga uh, uh, create or ito yung nakikreate uh, na ito yung mga uh, nakikreate about na ating self or ito pa yung uh, madedevelop or ito yung nagagawa kumbaga ito yung mga nagagawa natin everyday about religions aesthetic, uh, aesthetics moral dito natin malaman kung ano yung tama at mali something like that so it's let's move on to uh, the physical view of the self so free fluid Fred uh, assert that the human psyche or personality structure into three parts or tripartite. So according to the according to Freud, um, may tatlong personality yung isang tao. Uh, number one is id or international desire, ego and super ego. So when we say id, ito yung mga uh, internal desire. Kung ano ba yung ginugusto mo or gugustuhin mo talaga. Ito yung uh, parts of personal internal desire. So, in other words, it is unreality. Para siyang fantasia or fantasia no. It is a fantasy, brother. So, ito yung parang dito to. Oh. Parang guni-guni lang ng sarili niya. Yun yung personality ng isang tao yung kaya niya mag-imagine, yung ganun. Tapos, ego. It is reality. Ito yung, kung anong nakikita niya. Kung ano yung, nandiyan, ah, ito, totoo, to, to, parang ganun. So, it is an ego or conscious. Or it is a reality. So, super ego or conscience. In other words, it is morality. So, super ego, it is a, uh, yung tao na inaalala mo na yung tama at mali. Kung baga balance, it is binabalance yung id at ego. So, dapat, nandito talaga tayo when mag-isa tayo or yung 
mga bagay na gusto niyo natin, dapat si Super Ego talaga yung masusunod. Kasi dito nalalaman niya na uh, mas binabalance niya yung or binabalance niya yung kung parang advance in mag-isip or what is the possible uh, future happen. Ano ba yung mga posibilidad yung mangyayari or um, na ano na yung bad and good. So, let's proceed. So, uh, Freudian and stage of psychological and development. So, in this table, the period of psychological stage and development. So, ito yung mga uh, stage about sa ating uh, development or yung pag-grow natin as from child to be an adult or something like that. So, it is the stage oral uh, anal prothesis palate latency genital so in the or in the stage oral may siyang age of 0 to 18 months so ito yung mga activities mouth sucking bath and chewing so makita naman talaga natin na kapag bata pag yung edad ng bata is uh, 1 to 18 months Ito yung mga activities na siyempre kita uh, tayo is nakaranas din ng uh, galing din tayo dito eh. Uh, di pa natin na lalaman kung ginagawa natin. Di nga natin nalasan kung ito ba yung uh, masarap. Di natin yung yung baga uh, kain lang tayo ng kain. Yung ganun. Tapos so, number 3 is anal. It is 18 to 36 months. Anal, ay uh, anals bowel and bladder control so dito sa so stage na nagkakaroon na tayo ng hiya yung may mga parte na uh, kinakaya na talaga natin na makita ng ibang tao so, palethic are 3 to 3 to 6 years genital and masturbation so dito na pala sa palethic ito uh, genitals dito na nagsisimula yung mga mas, nagwa-masturbate yung mga bata or it is the stage na nag-grow na sila so latency it is 6 years to puberty reception of sexual feelings so in this uh, years to ito yung 6 years or pataas na or from Oh, puberty. Then, repression of sexual feelings. Dito na yun naman yung mga about sexual. Yung mga, dito na tala na, dito na minsan na-determine yung, uh, yung bata na about, uh, na-determine kung mo, parang dito na lumalabas yung what is, or kung sino ba talaga sila. Maybe a true girl or a gay uh, genital the puberty ma maturization and sexual orientation so genital ito yung pagmamatured ng isang tao or na orient na sila about sa sexuality or sexual uh, because in this stage is, it's all about maturity or nagmamatured na talaga this topic it's about kay Erickson's the stage year of its final version. So uh ito yung mga stage about our life development. Kasi habang tumatagal tayo or habang tumataas yung mga edad natin, yung mga activities and mga layunin natin sa buhay is bumag nagbabago rin um, uh, yung pag uh, uh, nagdedepende sa ating uh, age y or a stage so in about in this in the age of 0 to 1 year or the age and the stage of infancy rather in the age of 0 to 1 year it is the basic trust and mistrust and it's the conflict and the solution for the virtue it is the hope and the prophecy and the appreciation and interdependence of relatedness. So, in the stage of infancy, dito yung 
ay yung bata, humbaga, uh, unti-unting matututo. Because next stage, it is a early childhood. In the age of 1 to 3 years, it is the conflict of anonymous and shame, a shame, will, acceptance, and cycle of life from integrity to integration. So, in the age of uh, 1 to 3, dito yung tanggap ng uh, cycle of life. And then, the second stage, or in, or in the 1 to 3 years, dito na sila yung stepping stone nila to learn. It is to to learn and in this age, it is more about Eid. So, number, uh, next stage, it is about the place to use for the humor and fatigue and resilience. So, dito na yung mga uh, purpose. Yung parang unti-unti na nilang um, namimit yung about purpose ng life or humor or empathy and resilience. In the school age, and the stage of school age and the age of 6 to 12 years, industry and inferiority or competence, humanity, acceptance, course of life, course of one's life, and unfulfilled needs, hopes. So, in this age, dito na yung rebuild yung humanity nila, yung pagtanggap or pag, um, parang inisip na what is the course for the best of one's life. Tapos, yung, yung dito na yung, uh, yeah, unfulfilled na yung mga uh, hope nila. The next stage is adolescence. 12 to 19 years. Identify the confusion. So, in this age, um, it is focus, it is more on focused on build a relationships. The horse of one's life, I know, uh, expensive for merging sensory, logical, and aesthetic perception. Minsan, dito na yung nag-focus yung about uh, the uh, relationship, friendship, and this stage also, it is the stage of dating. So, but not serious. Kung baga, ano lang. Uh, it's for, just for fun. It is just for fun. So, ito yung uh, adolescence. So, second stage, it, uh, next stage, rather, it is the early adulthood, the intimacy and isolation, the love, a sense of competition, of relationship, part of terms of loving and fairly. So, in this early adulthood, uh, it is in having or it yung, yung exercise nila yung uh, pagkakaroon ng interesting sa life or to find a partner or to create a new life with the family ito yung about creating ito yung or nag uh, yung stand out yung stand, stand ka na yung sarili, sarili mo pa or to make or build or create a new life with uh, for your loved ones or something like something else or ito yung nagpagdadepende ka na so, the second stage, or the next stage is the adulthood. Adulthood. So, uh, this generative versus stagnation. Or, ito na yung pag-care. Or, set, uh, set reduce for caring for others and make up your empathy and concern. So, in an adulthood, ito na yung Diyan pa rin yung love, but more on care. More on care na kasi naranasan nila about uh, about from the beginning to sa kanilang age na about 64 to this view 64. Di natin lang best kasi about um, sabi nga nila, age is just a number. Maybe age ka na lang ng 26 pero yung uh, yung isip mo it's more on matured na talaga or yung parang pang matanda na or baka 
yung parang adulthood na and you earn the stage of adult adulthood so ito yung caring for others ito na yung stage na nagigay ka na sa iba or um, ito na yung pagka, pagkakaroon ng uh, child or the stage ito na talaga dapat talaga yung pagkakaroon ng child or yung brain niya din hindi, hindi. Eh, sabi, sabi nga nila it's uh, age is just a number so hindi yung nagbabase sa age pero in the stage of erex, er, erexons ito yung dapat or not dapat pero ito yung stage kung baga and the last is the old age or integrity versus despair or wisdom enter na siya identity or sense of in- integ- uh, integrity strong enough and wisdom physical and desegregation so in this age uh, integrated anything for the native uh, negative and positive the only way it is to happy because your life is getting short and getting dependent so in this age kasi is ito na yung parang inin, inilalaan mo na yung sarili mo or yung time mo to make it happy in this world kasi bilang na yung araw mo ito yung wisdom or ito na yung Uh, parang i-enjoy mo na lang lahat kasi anytime pwede ka nang wala because you are in the stage of uh, dying kasi it, it, parang bilang na yung mga araw mo so thank you everyone and thank you for listening